Hello everyone, welcome back to Voxel Tycoon. This is the Great Expanse. Right, okay, so we've got uh, got here, uh, we're at the laboratory, the, the research park, where we're currently, let's just up the tempo here, we're currently working through a uh, cash-based research, heavy electric engine, right? Um, yeah, so we've got the... Uh, a few more bits here for cash that need to be completed and yeah that's uh that's going to tick along here right it won't take long to uh to run through that now uh we've got uh this doesn't lead to anything we got researching two which uh uh, needs uh, circuit boards. I'll run through researching two and then uh, we'll do computing devices and that should be uh, which needs the circuit boards and this other stuff. Uh, so uh, yeah we should be sh I should be able to run through the rest of the uh, research and get computing devices started here and then uh, once we've done that uh, things will just tick along in the background until we get the windscreen, right? And that will, uh, uh, that's going to use a lot of resources while we're doing that. But, you know, we've got lots of cash, so we don't have to worry about that. And, uh, yeah, so we're just about done here with heavy electric engine. Uh, and once I launch computing devices, I think I'm going to start, uh, doing a bunch of, uh, work, uh, possibly on uh, rationalizing the rail network and all of that business, right? Uh, maybe. Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, you know, quite frankly, it's uh, it's uh, uh, it's fairly tedious work to uh, rebuild everything, right? Uh, but maybe I'll I'll take a a swipe at uh, going through how I typically build things and why. Uh, and then, uh, then we can, uh, you know, figure out, uh, stuff here. So we've completed heavy electric engine. Uh, if we start, uh, the, uh, uh, research two, as you can see, we're just going to run through circuit, uh, circuits here, right? Uh, and we're, we're just, we just need to, uh, tick through that. We should tick through that pretty quickly. Uh, we will end up waiting on uh, research uh, material, the, the circuits, right? Uh, as we wait for the trucks to arrive with everything, right? Um, yeah. Well, we did get uh, one truckload arrive here, but this will slow it down a little bit, uh, and that's fine. Uh, uh, you know, it's not, uh, not that, uh, that big of an issue. Um, but we've got enough throughput here, bringing stuff in that, uh, that it'll get done reasonably quickly. Now, uh, if we uh, head over here, yeah, so that thing, uh, remember I was talking about, uh, uh, you know, explaining what I typically do with, uh, with my, uh, uh, rail operations and why things like that well uh, over here uh, we can run uh, a dual track across here right uh, and uh, and that will give us uh, uh, it could replace this track down here going on all around like this right uh, I could bring this straight out here uh, and it'll fit within the road grid, right? That's why I, I, I was using this road as a guide. It would fit within the road grid. And then what I can do, I can, uh, uh, you know, I could raise this by three and I could do a viaduct type operation or embankment across here. And then I uh, come down. And if I keep it within the road grid, then the towns, they, they don't... Uh, they don't get uh, confused or whatever, build dead end roads all over, right? Now, to make all of this work, uh, like for instance, this town wants to grow this way, right? 
Uh, so if I were to take this stuff out here, and just take all of this stuff out, yeah, we have cash, so why not, right? Uh, so we can do this, and uh, take this out, and this out, and this out, and even take that out, uh, and even back this up a, a little bit here, right? Uh, now, I could, uh, right, I can take this out, back to there. Now, we come in. Now, I could just build this as a, uh, I could just flatten this, you know, do this. Um, well, I'm actually going to do that a, a, a little bit here. Uh, take that out and that out. And, you know, if I flatten this. Now, this is with the current game mechanics, right? When they get level crossings in, we'll be able to just blast this across and build level crossings, right? But uh, what I would do uh, typically is I would come in, uh, you know, our, our rail line, our road is going to be here, right? And our rail needs to get, needs to be here, right? So if I were to bring that up three and then back to here, right? Uh, I can uh, now use this. And do this. Then I can build myself a uh, uh, embankment all the way across here, right, at the three, uh, three block, three voxel level, right. So then, if I were to come along and uh, do this, right, I could build uh, tracks out across like that. Right, and I do this. I build tracks out this way, right? Uh, okay, so now I've got two tracks. Now, uh, if we go back over into roads, I can build a road across here, right? Uh, now, from here, we can connect into this existing road here. We can connect into this existing road here. But here's the thing we can do. We can tunnel across this flat, and now the road can go through the rail at uh, close intervals. See, like that. Now, if I measured this right, okay, yeah, now, and this can come in like this. Now, if I measured this right, this should be six uh, road widths. One, two, three, four, five, Six, yeah. So this road's in the right place. Now, the town can grow past the rail line here without being blocked by it, and the grid can be dense. Now, I could, uh, if it was going to be too expensive to build the embankment, like you don't taking a mountain down, uh, right, uh, you could do this as a bridge, but doing it this way uh, by doing it this way, I can edit it much more easily because I don't end up having to take out the entire bridge. Again, this is with the current game mechanics, right? So now, I could, uh, I could, fl I could uh, do some more uh, uh, landscaping. I could bring this out, say, to here. I could flatten this out to here, you know, something like that. I could even do the same over here, right? Right, I could do that, right? And then eventually I come over to a point where I, I would uh, bring the uh, branch off and bring the, uh, the line down that way. Now, uh, what I can do down here uh, because I can connect this into the existing uh, uh, infrastructure business here. Uh, now, if I were to come in here, extend this out like that. Okay. Now, if I was now to bring these out like this, uh, right. Now, 
I could. Nope. Nope. I could do this. Right? And I could do... Suppose... No. I could do this. Right? I could do that. And then I could bring this. Nope. Nope. I could do that, right? And then I could have my, uh, uh, I could run my uh, track. Uh, you know, I could take this piece of track out, right? Uh, which, uh, in fact, I'm going to do. Okay, take that out. And we haven't messed up the train operations here. Now, uh, I can go ahead and put in a uh, couple of signals here. Uh, say, I don't know, uh, here and here. And then we could come over another distance here and here maybe. And then we'd need need one there. Um, now, obviously, uh, this is not a two-way track, so I don't need this piece here, uh, right? Uh, this is a one-way track, comes down, comes into here, and then one ways into here, right? But, as you can see, this gets, gets us our rails running in a nice... Uh, convenient uh, grid operation, right? And then I can come in here and uh, help the towns out by uh, doing something like this. Right? And then we can do this. Uh-huh. Right. So then the town now has four crossings under the rail and it can do its thing here. Uh, and if I wanted to, I could fix up the uh, gaps in the grid here as well. Right? Uh, but now that opens up this whole area in here to the town for development. Right? Uh, right. Now, uh, what I would probably do here is, you know, on a personal game is I'd flatten everything out in this area uh, is there's plenty of cash to do it I'd flatten everything inside here um, right the other thing I would probably do is get rid of this water uh, which we can do like this if we do it the lazy way which we're gonna do uh, we, we, we can get rid of the water you know like that and you know, might as well get rid of it all the way for the road. Yeah, and then we uh, just flatten it back out. See, that's what I would do uh, in uh, typically in my uh, my game, right? Uh, yeah, you know, and then the town has all of this area to expand into without complications, right? Uh, and of course, I wouldn't be building any infrastructure in here either. You know, is this would be the extent of the factory would be this road, and then the town could fill this in, and uh, then we'd be uh, we just have uh, more town in there, right? And so that's that's basically uh, what I would uh, I would normally do. Uh, you know, just idling time. Uh, you know, just idling around with the game is I would be doing things like that, especially with if we look in here and we see that we're bringing in um, uh, you know, like a million uh, you know, y y you know, we're bringing in something like uh, uh, in the order of a million uh, monthly, right? So we have plenty of cash. Uh, right, okay, so we can take that out. Now, if we look in 
in here uh, and we go and look in the lab here uh, we're uh, a fair chunk of the way to done with uh, with researching two I don't know what researching two buys you but it's on the research list so I figured I'd just uh, chuck it in there and uh, I'd do it right um, yeah uh, that's uh, essentially uh, why it's there anyway uh, we've got a fair chunk of, uh, of the uh, researching two completed. Uh, we only have 22 more research days there. Uh, you know, so, uh, so we're going to, uh, wa to wait that out. And then, uh, then I'll launch computing devices in this, this part for sure. And then uh, it's uh, there's going to be at least one more part to the uh, the series uh, because it's going to take quite a while to research computing devices. So I'll probably go in and uh, start um, uh, adjusting the uh, the rail network so that it's a little more sane. Um, yeah, maybe uh, something like that. Anyway, uh, right. Um, you know, and I might start, uh, uh, I might consider actually uh, uh, grabbing an unlimited resources mod or something like that. But no, I may, no, uh, having resources run out is actually part of the, uh, the game, right? Um, although, if I were to grab uh, an unlimited resources mod, uh, then I could start working on delivering much greater quantities of merchandise to uh, to locations and uh, really uh, getting things uh, running. Uh, you know, I, I could potentially do that, and maybe I'll do that here uh, because with these uh, exp these larger areas, uh, uh, you know, by the time you you've uh, run out of a few uh, resources. Uh, you're at a point where your computer's chugging because the map's too big <laughs> if you unlock another region, right? Um, right, yeah, so I'm not, uh, I'm probably not going to do that uh, uh, for too long before before this, uh, you know, fails hard, right? Uh, okay, we're at uh, uh, 130 uh, of 135, so we got five more, right? And... Uh, uh, it won't be too long be able to change the research here so we're going to have because uh, researching two doesn't lead to anything it just gives us laboratory two um, i don't think we need laboratory two uh, okay so we need some uh, some more uh, circuits to arrive right and uh, there we go that's uh, Okay, that's going to be it for uh, laboratory or researching two. There we go, researching two. Now the only other possible research is computing devices. This takes four hundred and fifty research days, uh, three hundred and or thirty-four million uh, dollars, uh, five point nine thousand, or like fifty-nine hundred circuits. Uh, 4,500 copper wire, uh, 3,600 televisions, 2,300 radios, and uh, the copper wire and circuit and uh, the circuits are going to suck up copper wire as well, and uh, these uh, TVs and radios are going to suck up circuits. So this will um, this will uh, suck up a lot of resources for quite a while. So we'll start it. Uh, right. Uh, so, you know, we're doing 75, 76 K per research day, right? Uh, so we're going to end up with quite a lot of traffic ticking around here and, uh, yeah, it's going to, it's going to take a while to do this research. Uh, so there's at least one more part while that's happening for sure. Uh, anyway. Uh, let's uh, let's go back up here and uh, look at our uh, rail network again. Now, uh, what I can do uh, also over here, and I'll have to pause it to do that. Um, 
is I could rejig this whole operation here so that the uh, the through rail going through this way can just come in and run into here and then I just I don't need to uh, and then I can uh, adjust things around here and you know what I think that's what I'm going to do uh, at this point here so I'm going to pause it and I'm going to grab uh, this kill that and all of this kill all of this uh, yeah uh, okay now I'm going to make sure I can get uh, three up because I'm going to no I can't get it that way um, okay uh, I want three up because I'm going to to do that here too one two three four one two three up okay good right okay that means I need this right and see we're gonna run into this stuff here uh, but I'll deal with that okay what I need to do though is uh, rail yeah uh, I need to get up the slope here yeah uh, with this up to here no yeah we'll go up to here yeah and then this one needs to do the same uh, goes up to here right and then we can do the same with uh, this uh, bit here right uh, okay we need uh, landscaping again uh, we need to come out like this nope like this okay and then okay this comes in like this yeah. so if we build the full um no uh no the full in intersection here yeah like that and we can do this yeah and then nope we can do this yep okay so that gives us uh, a full intersection thing going on there right um, and we can back this up a bit right and we can do the same thing on this side right uh, we do this right now we can bring this guy up like that good now we can also do this and nope this yeah yeah and this only goes one way down this way right so i don't need that to uh to have anything more going on um right this is only bringing the copper pickup in from here so i can bring uh i can do i can do this yes i can do that uh yeah, so that's uh, a ridiculous uh, setup, but I can do that, uh, and that will allow uh, stuff to come in through there, right? Um, right. Now, uh, uh, what I would, I should be able to actually, no, I, I can't just, what, wait, no, I can okay I can un uh, do we have any complaints here no uh, okay um, right 
So that should all theoretically work. Oh, well, right. I need to do some uh, signal work here. Uh, so we need a pre-signal here. Yeah, that works. So we need a pre-signal there. Uh, one there and one here, right? And we need a regular signal here, uh, here, uh, here, and here, right? Yeah, uh, okay. And then I think we probably want to do this. Yeah, we probably do. Okay, that, that works, good. Now, um, what I can do is I can bring this up to here. And then I can bring it all the way across like this. Yeah. Uh, okay, so this is where it lines up, right? Um, right. So this would come across like this. And I see we're one voxel off here. Right. Okay. Right. We're one voxel off there. And that's fine. So, uh, what I would, I'll do here, uh, because we can't, uh, we can't get a track through there, right? Um, so uh, what I can do here is uh, I can come up to here and then we can do this. Uh, we can do this and then we can come back around down this way. Uh, right, to there, right? Uh, we can definitely do that. And then, because uh, that copper operation is going to be there for a little while. And then, okay, we can do this. And we can do this, right? And then there'd be just, just that little uh, single track detour there, right? Okay. Then what uh, what we do here is we put a pre-signal going in there and a pre-signal going in there, right? And then we put a uh, regular signal coming out and a regular signal coming out. Right. So then this single track operation can do what it's doing there, right? And then... Our next uh, order of business is this junction here, which would be a pain. Um, yeah, it will be a bit of a pain. Um, uh, now, one of the things we can't do is kink a uh, rail over by a single voxel. So when I redo this, I'm going to have to redo it all the way to here. Yeah. Um, for that iron ore uh, pickup there, right? Uh, and that's going to take uh, a little bit of fiddling, right? But anyway, this is what we can do here uh, to, get, uh, to get things, uh, you know, uh, rationalized for the main network. You know, and this would be a sort of main line across the uh, side to side across the map, right? All the way over through to here, right? And uh, yeah, that would, uh, that works out pretty well in my experience if you build that. And uh, you might think that this type of junction is going to be horribly inefficient and cause a lot of blockage, right? Well, it depends on the volume of trains you have running through a junction uh, like this, whether you're going to get blockage or not.
and uh, we don't have a volume of trains here, that's going to make that junction fail. Uh, we might end up with the occasional queuing, you know, if uh, too many trains arrive at the same time. But keep in mind, all the trains coming from this way are pretty much coming out of here after dropping off their load. And the stuff coming through this way, and what will eventually be coming through this way, will only be doing so to get into this station to drop off their load. Now, ultimately, I suspect this track here will be, I would remove this track, and I'd probably bring a, uh, a more, uh, you know, uh, a, a, a dual track line, probably down around here, uh, through this way, and then we could take peel off the track onto here, and I would probably dual track this, but I'm not uh, completely certain about that. Uh, when this uh, this wood uh, runs out, uh, we won't need this uh, loop here anymore, right? So uh, that's the sort of thing you know that uh, that we uh, deal with here. This stone. Uh, will eventually run out and then this track won't be needed uh, coming up this way and then we'll just have this going straight across here right uh, so that's the general idea you know having a sort of main line across there and stuff connecting to it to uh, collect our resources right uh, and you'll note that I'm doing all final delivery with uh, trucks uh, and it turns out that that works very well with the current game mechanics. Uh, if you've got enough road capacity, uh, you can do uh, quite a bit with just trucks. Now, we're up at half an hour here for the part, so I'm just going to check in on our lab here. And as I suspected, circuits is going to be our uh, bottleneck. But we're, we've done 10% of the research, so it's going to take a while to do that. So I'll be back, uh, you know, at least one more time, maybe two or three. Uh, we'll get computing devices done and maybe fiddle around with the, uh, the rail network a little bit in the meantime. But uh, once I've done that, I don't think there's all that much more that's entertaining with the current game mechanics. So then I'll uh, probably leave the, uh, I'll leave this saved. And I'll, I'll uh, go on with something else for a little bit. And then, depending when the next update comes, which uh, is supposed to have some uh, major improvements on quite a few things, you know, when that comes, uh, then yeah, we'll, we'll have uh, maybe uh, a good reason to go into all of this again and rejigger all of this, or you know, maybe revisit the map, right? Or maybe not. It's, uh, it's hard to say. Uh, I'm not. Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, so, uh, as I could do another one of these, it'd be more of the same. Uh, do it again. Uh, same thing again. Uh, I don't know if that's terribly exciting, right? Uh, so I think uh, the next time I do a series, uh, we'll probably end up with a passenger network when the passenger transfers and everything are in. Uh, I'm not sure though, uh, and I don't know when that will be either. Um, right. Okay. Well, that's going to be that's going to be it for this uh, this episode, right? So, uh, yeah, we've got uh, we've got stuff ticking along here. Uh, if, if we look in here, uh, we've got uh, we're producing everything at a high enough rate to meet our demand at the moment. So. Uh, yeah, everything everything is fine. So, uh, yeah, uh, eventually we'll get the windscreen here, and then uh, I don't know for the uh, uh, the three of you that are actually watching these. Uh, uh, what do you think I should do with the uh, with the save? Should I continue uh, tinkering with it? Uh, would you be at all interested in seeing that? Uh, keeping in mind that it'd probably be quite tedious. Or uh, should I go on with something else? Uh, and if it's something else, uh, do you have any suggestions for what that should be? Uh, you know, uh, leave a comment. Uh, let me know. 
uh, anyway, uh, that's going to be all for this time. So, you know, like, comment, subscribe, you know, that, that usual business. Uh, or dislike if you prefer. And, of course, the bell thing. It may or may not give you some notifications. And you might find that useful or not. Uh, uh, that's it. I guess see you back next time.